Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel Crochet Online Course. So in this today's video, I'm going to share the pattern for this sweater. For this pattern, you need to have 3.0 millimeter hook and three ply yarn. For starting this pattern, I'm going to make some chains. So this pattern is actually the multiple of 18 chains. So you have to make 18 plus 18 plus 18 to your size. If you are making some big projects, you need to add plus 18 and the last is add 2 chains for the ending. So this is easy and fast because the stitches are big and you will make it very fast i'm here doing some chains just to show you the pattern okay here i have done about 42 chains so now move to the first row for the first row skip two stitches and in the third stitch do a double crochet okay this is the first row so i am going to do half double crochet in each and every stitch if you like you can make a single crochet or double crochet in this line this is just a border so this will work as border so if you like you don't need to make a border you just start with chains row of half double crochet is done now move to the next row for the next row i am doing three chains like this and flip your work now skip the first stitch and in the second stitch a double crochet and in the next stitch again a double crochet so in total you will have three stitches in the start like this now make three chains one two and three three chains like this okay so now again skip two stitches and in the third stitch one double crochet again a double crochet and third double crochet so this is the pattern of the second row you need to make three chains three double crochets three chain three double crochets so this is a pattern of the row two so you can make these rows according to your size i'm just here doing only two rows just to show you the pattern but this is up to you you can make these in the upper side or you can make in the uh, you can make with them sleeves or other I'm just showing the pattern of this stitch.
here you can see the three rows of the pattern is are done now the main pattern is starting from here I have made made three chains and I will do here seven double crochets so one double crochet two three and four five and two double crochet in the space or you can do it in the chains so i am doing in the chains so in total from the start i have eight stitches so this is necessary you need to have eight stitches in start and eight stitches in the last eight double crochets okay now two chains like this and skip two stitches one and two and in the third stitch one double crochet like this now again two chains and now i will make 13 double crochets so starting and end will have eight double crochets but in the middle part you will have to make 13 double crochets so i'm here doing 13 double crochets in the chains and on the stitches do not skip any stitch you can see 13 double crochets here are done now i will again do two double uh, two chains skip two stitches and one double crochet again two sorry i'm doing it wrong skip this part just do two chains skip two stitches and again 13 double crochets like I have done before in the last I again have made 8 stitches so in the start and last you need to make eight chain eight double crochets or eight stitches this is a must so pattern will go correctly now move to the next row for the next row again do three chains now i will do uh, skip the last two stitches so in total i will have six stitches in the start and six stitches in the last so here I will do 5 double crochets and in total there will be 6 stitches. Skip the last. So here you can see now skip the last 2 row or last 2 stitches and make 2 chains like this. Now I will do 5 double crochet in single double crochet in this single stitch. So do 5 double crochet, 1, 2, 3, 4 double crochet and 5. So
so here you can see now again two double crochet two chains and skip first two stitches in the third in the third and onward do double crochet each and every stitch but again skip two stitches in last so in the last previous row we have done here 13 double crochets so now there will be nine double crochets here because we have skipped two double crochet in start and two double crochet in the end so here skip the last two and skip the first again two chains and again five double crochet in the single stitch so repeat this after and after and in the last of the row i have done six stitches so next row again three chains flip your work and in this row again we will skip two double crochets so we will have four stitches in the start like this okay four skip the last two stitches and again do two chains like this and make five double crochets in the first of the double crochet okay make here five double crochets one two three double crochet four double crochet and five so here you can see i have done five double crochets in the first stitch first stitch of the last rows five okay now again i will do five double crochets in the last stitch again five so one two double crochet three four and the last so we have two clusters here two uh, shells you can see it shell again two chains skip first two stitches and from third to next make in the previous row we had make nine nine so here we'll make five stitches five double crochets in total here like this okay five are done now again two chains five double crochet in the first stitch and again five double crochets in the last stitch so this will be repeated this is the repeated and the center pattern you can add 18 plus 18 plus 18 chains to make this pattern but remember you need to make eight stitches in start and last so okay this row is done now we are on the next row for the next row again three chains so in this row we will again skip two stitches for total in start we will have two stitches only now two chains and here in this row i will do three shells for this make one shell in the first of the first five crochets five double crochets five double crochets here four and five one shell is complete now make the second shell in the center of two okay one shell is here one double crochet two double crochet three double crochet four and five okay two shells are done now we will do our last shell of this line okay in the last stage again do five double crochets in this single stage one double crochet two double crochet three double crochet four and the last five double crochet so you can see i have done three shells in this row now again 
टू चेन्स एंड स्किप फर्स्ट टू फर्स्ट टू स्टिच वन टू एंड इन द थर्ड वन डबल क्रोशे एंड अगेन स्किप लास्ट टू स्टिच सो वी विल हैव ओनली वन डबल क्रोशे सो अगेन टू चेन्स एंड रिपीट द पैटर्न This row is done. You can see here. Now the now we will re, uh, repeat this the row where I have made two shelves. So two shelves row will be repeated here. For this we will add two more stitches in the start and middle end. So here I will have four stitches. So again we will add two more stitches here. One and two stitches. So in total, I have four in starting. Like this. Now again, two chains, two chains, and I will do two shells here in the middle of the shells. We will make two shells in the middle of the shells. So sorry, I forgot to add two chains here. I will redo it. Just redo it because I have I forgot this. So I'm repeating the row number where I have done only two shells. So this is a row of two shells. So make five double crochets in the middle stitch of two shells. So four double crochets and five. One is done. Now again, make the next one. Our next one will be made in the middle of the two shells. So five double crochets. Again, three two double crochets. So this is easy and just repeated pattern. You just need to make sure that what row will be repeated. This is not very tough. You need to so your first row will be of one shell, then two shells, then three shells, and again we will minus one shell, one shell. So it is done. Now make two chains, and we here we will again add two more stitches here. So in total we will have five stitches. So make two double crochets in the space. Like this, and one double crochet over the double crochet, and again two stitches in the next space. So in total we have five stitches. So this is just repeated row. This completed. The row is done. Now we will repeat the row where I have done only one shell. For this, we will add plus two stitches. So I will make one, one double crochet, two double crochet, so in this row, we will add two double crochets in the end, in the starting. So four and again we'll do two double crochets in total we will have six stitches in the starting of our pattern and this is the six so you can see we have six like we had in the one shell pattern so again one two chain and we'll have make one shell stage in the middle of the two shells so one double crochet, two double crochet, three double crochet, four, four and five. So you can see. And now again two chains and add two double crochets in space. This and next two 
next to make double crochets on each and every stitch so in total there will be nine stitches here three four five six seven add two in the next space like we have done in previous row uh, previous and this is the ninth double crochet so here you can see how we are done so this is the row of one shell so next repeat the thing so here i have completed now we i am repeating the row where i have done 13 double crochets and eight double crochets in start this is easy and you just need to make sure that what row you are repeating so these are about four rows pattern one two three four then again three two one so this is the repeating process in this pattern so i'm repeating the repeating here row number one in row number one we had eight stitches in start and no shell stitch one double crochet in the middle again two chains and 13 double crochets so this is our row number one next we will make row number two three four then three two one so this is just repeated pattern you just make in mind that what row you are repeating don't make any uh, mistake this is not very tough 